Hello, my name is José Duran Brisbois. I'm the Senior Curator of Contemporary Art. Today I would like to talk to you about a masterpiece in the Contemporary Art Collection of the National Gallery of Canada, 40-part motet by Canadian artist Janet Cardiff. What we see with the sound installation is 40 speakers that are arranged around the gallery space. We're very lucky at the National Gallery to be able to showcase this piece within the Rideau Chapel, which is a work of art in and of itself. Originally designed by Georges Bouillon, an architect and a priest, for the Rideau Convent on Rideau Street. It was later dismantled in 1972. All its different parts were stored in different locations to be reassembled inside the National Gallery in the core of the Canadian galleries. Thomas Tallis composed this polyphonic piece of music for eight choirs of five voices, or five parts, including soprano, alto, tenor, baritone, and bass. He actually originally conceived it for a chapel that had eight alcoves, so this idea of creating a sculptural sense of the sound was very important, and Janet Cardiff was drawn to this. And so in a way, the 40-part motet is a reworking of the spem in allium. What she was quite interested in, what she says, is that she wanted to climb inside this piece of music. Cardiff devised a complex recording process in which she captured the voice of each singer individually. She had them each wear a microphone that was put on a mount specifically in front of them that would only capture their voice. So in a way, each time that we're approaching one speaker, it is as if we're approaching that singer specifically and we can hear their voice. Another thing that's quite interesting and often not talked about is the fact that Cardiff really liked the versions of Spen and Allium that featured children's voices. And so for the soprano parts, she decided to work with children, so boys and girls. And in the end, there were 59 tracks that were actually recorded individually and then mixed. Only the soprano voices were mixed to create the 40 parts of the 40 part motet. Another important element is the fact that there are two moments in the 40 part motet. There is also the intermission. And the intermission was, you know, during a break while they were recording the 40 part motet, which was a three hour recording session. They decided to keep recording as the singers were only talking and, and you know laughing and clearing their throats and some of them are doing scales and it's a beautiful moment because it's a moment when you see and you hear that these are human beings and there's a personal connection with the listener with the viewer and then that, that first one yeah. here we see a contemporary art piece shown within a historical context of the Rideau Chapel to create such a moving experience for our visitors. I hope you will come and listen and enjoy with us soon.